I have bought way more products because of TikTok than I would like to admit. Some of them end up being complete fails. For anyone who's wondering how my Venus flytrap is doing. I want one of these so bad. I Get him. Oh, I swear <laughs> to God. You're going to kill my plant, sir. Oh, he's going for another one. Get him, get him, get him, get him. <laughs> I'm getting one. I have to show you what I just bought. I have never been happier. But other things that I bought from TikTok have ended up being big, big wins. So today we have a bunch of new ones to test out. This first one is an advertisement that will not leave me alone. Every time I would log into TikTok, this was the first thing on my For You page. It's one of those TikToks too, where you're like, oh, just a girl showing her cute outfit. And then that shop now tab slowly moves into frame and you realize I've been swindled into watching 10 seconds of an ad. So I bought them thinking I can make one of those funny videos about like expectation versus reality. Cause there's no way these are good. Like the brand name, what is that? Edited, but they just like threw a K in there, <laughs> what? Here's what the website looks like. Everything is on sale right now. It was not on sale when I got these. <laughs> okay, Luna faux leather flare jeans. Normally $80 on sale. I didn't have high hopes because anything that has the word jeans and also stretchy in the description, I don't trust. I went with a size large. I figured it would be better to err on the side of sizing up. So I got them and let me tell you, I will say their packaging is pretty cute. Whoa. Okay, looks pretty legit. Wait, I think for the first time, an advertisement did not lie They're to me. They're cute, like what? I'm on the taller side, so the fact that these are actual, truly full length on me, amazing. I keep wanting to like pull them up. Someone commented on my TikTok and was like, they're not supposed to be high rise. I don't know how to not do high rise. Everything I own is high rise. Even my underwear is high rise. That's why you can see it in the back. These are so cute though. Not sure how to wash them yet, but I am pleasantly surprised by these. Oh, and all the pockets are real. When I saw this TikTok, I knew immediately I had to have this in my life. 22 million views. Ooh! And you put the water where the soap goes and the dials and buttons even work. Look at it just spinning. Oh! Okay, so I found this one on Amazon. Theo Klein store is where it's from. It was $61, which I mean, yes, you could just wash your stuff in the, the sink for free, but this is what my beauty blender looks like. I couldn't even tell you what color this used to be. So I thought maybe if I get something fun, then I'll actually wash this. Tyler's gonna be so confused why there's just a tiny washing machine on our bathroom counter, but. <laughs> oh, I see it's a manual. Oh, there's even a door open button. Watch, watch. <laughs> soap concoction. Why do I feel like I'm 10 years old again making potions out of my mom's soaps in the bathroom? Pop this little guy in. Soap's gonna go in here. I don't know how much to put. Oh no! <laughs> what? Why is it coming out of that tube? That's not supposed to happen. Literally none of it actually went into the machine. Yes, okay, now it's full enough that it's actually submerging a little bit. <sighs> nice clean floor after this. This smells like champagne toast. Ooh, there it goes. Oh, it's getting clean. <laughs> Look at it. Here's the thing, as cute as this is, I'm obviously still gonna have to take it out and rinse it in the sink anyway, so. Something tells me this was never meant to actually have water in it. Why was it $60 then? Like. That's a lot for a toy washing machine that doesn't even work. No, how do I get it out now? No! <laughs> wow, it's not really any cleaner. Well, that water's gross. <laughs> Can you see how yellow it is? I'm gonna put it in the laundry room as a decoration. <laughs> By the way, in case you missed the news, I'm giving away a Peloton bike to one of you guys because I love mine, it absolutely changed my life. And a thousand dollars to another one of you to spend wherever you want. If we can get to one million subscribers before the end of this year. So make sure to hit that button if you haven't already. You guys have been killing it. So when we get to 800, I'm gonna pick one of you guys to give an Apple Watch to. We're raising the stakes. All right, this is a brand that I have been following forever on TikTok and we're finally gonna try it. They've had quite a few viral videos. For First one that I ever saw was this one where they just like explain a little bit about the brand and what it is. We're Heather and Jane. We decided we hate our bras. Our clothing does everything a bra can do. 
but without one. Our clothes are made to last so that they don't end up in a landfill, so that you can love your Frankly clothes for a long time. Cause yeah, bras are the worst. <laughs> they also made this one that made me laugh so hard. <laughs> Wait, ma'am. Wait, I make braless clothing. <laughs> Their stuff is on the higher side price wise. So I'm expecting Phenomenal quality. Oh my gosh, look at the packaging. <laughs> okay, first item that I have is the Charlie mini dress. The sizes of this brand go from extra small to 2XL. They have like half sizes where you can pick your top size and your bottom size. I just went with medium, medium. Oh, this feels amazing. Are you kidding me? Look at the top. It's giving me lift. It's giving me shape. Kind of feels like a sports bra up top. It has removable cut pads, which you could take out. The fabric is like thick enough that you could get away without. And then I really like how the back is like, there's a big panel of like almost elasticy, stretchy material. So it's definitely made to fit a variety of different like bust sizes. Oh wait, you know what this needs? Now this is a whole look. <gasps> It has pockets too. This dress just keeps getting better and better. It is such good quality material too. There's almost like a like a handmade feel to it. Don't worry, there's a second box. Yes, in this one, we have the Ida corset top in this beautiful red. This one I also went with a medium, medium in. Okay, so this one is like a true corset. Thank you for putting them in the front and not the back. <gasps> This fits like a dream. I love how thick the straps are. It's made from the same material as the dress. There are no cup pads at all in this one, but like, like pretty thick. So it's still giving me coverage and support. And then the back has that same like stretchy material panel and adjustable straps. 11 out of 10 recommend. <laughs> Actually just placed another order for two more corsets and a bodysuit. I'll put my little friend referral link down in the description. It'll get both of us $15 off, non affiliate, just a good old fashioned friend code. <laughs> this next thing just literally came in the mail today. This one is technically not a small brand product. It's from Sephora. But listen, when I saw the video of this on TikTok, look at that sparkle. I don't even know how it's gonna look on, but I just knew I needed it in my life, okay? Oh my goodness. That is so pretty. <gasps> Wait, it actually, <gasps> Wait, it's lipstick, buddy. It's technically, it's called the Frost Lip Balm, so it's not meant to go on and look like lipstick. Ooh. That's so cool. I think it's gonna look really pretty over a lipstick though. I'll pop up a little video on the screen here. I'll try it for you. Could you find something cheaper than this was that has the same effect? Yeah, but <laughs> this is a fun one. But she has a bunch of these videos of her making this jewelry and they're all just so satisfying to watch. So they're in her little Etsy shop. This one's called the braided ring and you go select your ring size and then the color. Oh my goodness. Handmade jewelry is just the best. It's so cute. I went with the light blue and the silver and I'm gonna put it on my middle finger here and it's never coming off. I'm gonna have to go buy more. Also nine bucks for something handmade like this. So worth it. And finally with 5.3 million views, the Kim dress. Kim Kardashian moment. It's padded. The straps are everything. It has a split so you can move. But like the shape of that, you know I had to get it and try it. Oh my God. It smells so bad. But what's even funnier is they hand wrote me a note that says, I hope, thank you so much for supporting us. We hope you love what you ordered. This dress material might have a smell, but the smell will go away after washing or hanging it for a couple of hours. I love that they took the time to address it though. Like my femme, I think is how you say the name of the store. This particular dress was $43. Wait a minute. <laughs> okay, it's not giving me like the exact same curves as it looked in the video. <laughs> not bad though. I mean, it's like, don't expect any miracles. I think it's just meant to fit to the shape of your body. Like here's realistically what it looks like laying on the floor. <laughs> like honestly, when I pulled it out, just looking at like the quality, I wasn't sure. This would be such a cute Halloween costume if you wanted to be like a devil or something. <laughs> the stretch and the slits make it pretty easy to walk into. <laughs> Why do I feel like it's sexy Velma from Scooby-Doo in this? It has been sitting out for a couple hours now and it still smells terrible. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I always love trying new stuff like this with you. Leo and I picked out some other videos down below that we thought you might enjoy and we will see you guys over in the next one. Say bye YouTube.